Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to my camp. We're at my camp. That's where we are. We're gonna spend a little bit of time at my camp. Um, I was reminded that uh, I picked up some new plans uh, a couple episodes ago when we were claiming workshops. And um, I've never really even looked at those plans or even tried to build them. So, you know, it might be fun to um, see if we could build some of these plants. I am a little concerned about this budget business that goes on here at the camp that I don't completely understand. We may run into that budget, but if we do, we'll try to figure something out. Right now, I'm just scrolling through here to see if there are any plans or recipes that I haven't read yet. A uh, plan for a cigarette machine and um, a recipe for Formula P, whatever that is. Formula P, plus five charisma, plus three luck. And improves gun accuracy for five minutes. Interesting. Okay. So let's go ahead and learn that as well. So the first thing I want to do is actually um, not something that I gained uh, during my uh, workbench claims. Uh, I want to uh, craft something that I got in the atomic shop for free uh, that I thought looked kind of neat. Uh, and I, uh, I wasn't sure how to get it but I, I looked here at the armor workbench and uh under outfits you could see stuff here so this pink pantsuit here uh whoops is um what i just got in the atomic shop so pink pantsuit let's go ahead and make that that's just going to take some uh, cloth that's all so we'll make that and why not make all this stuff it's just going to take cloth uh, actually, now that I'm making them, I'm thinking, well, the reason you don't make them is because you're going to have to store them and then they're going to take up space. But oh well, whatever. That's okay. We're going to have a little fashion show right here. Uh, so let me go in here to my inventory and we're going to uh, take off all of this stuff that we've been wearing. Heck, I even forgot what my character looked like. It's been so long since I've seen his face. So he is in his skivvies and we will take everything off. And then we will put on the pink pants suit. Uh, is that what that said? Pink? Is that what that said? Pink pants suit. That's what it says. And I gotta say, looking pretty good. I, I I think that looks great. That looks really, really good. I am quite pleased with the way that looks. Yes, indeed. So uh, we're going to lounge around in this for a bit. Uh, it includes shoes, it looks like. It's pretty nice. Yeah, I really like it. I like it a lot. And watch this. Whoa. That was scary. That was a strange, strange timing. Boing. I <laughs> just shot that dog. Uh, I don't think this one's working. And I don't think this one's going to do much of anything anyway, uh, where it is. I mean, who's going to come at me from this direction? So let's pick this thing up. Uh, switch to modify. Uh, we're going to... Hmm, I guess I can't pick it up. I need to repair it first, maybe. No? Um... Hmm. How do I... Switch to build? Uh, no, I don't want to build it. I want to pick it up. Um... I thought I could pick things up. Oh, here comes another dog. <laughs> um... Yeah, see, move. There we go, now move is available. It wasn't available before, you saw that. So we're just going to plop this down right here. Uh, yeah, there we go. We'll just do that. I, I, I feel like I used to have quite a few more turrets around here, but uh, they're all gone. I guess they they were destroyed or something. I don't know. But uh, that's okay. No big deal. Uh, get out of here. Yeah. Just uh, kind of hang out here on top of my camp with my uh, pink suit on and my white shoes I must say, the uh, Pip-Boy kind of clashes with it. I don't think it really goes with it. Uh, if I get a pink Pip-Boy, that might uh, go a little bit better. Let's bring up our um, construction thingy here. And it's kind of weird because I don't remember uh, the stuff that I picked up, uh, the plans that I picked up. So I don't even really know where to look for them. Um, you know what I'm saying? I... I I mean, maybe there's some uh, some lights I picked up, maybe. I, I really have no way of knowing what I picked up at um, the 
um, the workbenches, right? I mean, here's a light box. I don't know where I got that from. Um, and here is a fire barrel and oil lamp post. I do know where I got those. I pretty sure I bought those at somebody else's camp. Some different types of foods, some water, which reminds me I should probably go down there and uh, help myself to um, my own water. Yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, take my purified waters out of here. I mean, that's six purified waters for us, right? And, um, I mean, what do we got? Resources? What the heck is this thing? Scavenger Collectron Station. Okay. And, uh, fertilizer producer. Well, I could, if I really wanted to, I could put this fertilizer uh, producer down somewhere around here, but I really don't think I want to. Uh, appliances, I think some of these we may have picked up. Um, we got a stove here. Do I have a, a stove in here? Because I remember, I, yeah, I have a stove. Uh, apparently there's more variants. Oh, okay, there's this wood-burning stove. We've got a jukebox, which is pretty neat, huh? It needs to be powered. I don't see any reason to put a jukebox in here because it's not like I'm going to listen to it. we got an ice machine, a cigarette machine, Nuka-Cola machine, uh, and a bathtub. Yeah, I just now realized that uh, I never built myself a bathroom in this place, you know? There's no bathroom in this place. I guess I just, like, you know, go whizzing off the uh, balcony over here. That's what I do. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of somewhat interesting. Uh, beds. Um, a princess castle bed. Uh, chairs. Let's see. Is there, are there any new chairs in here that I haven't seen before? It doesn't really look like it. Uh, stash box, displays, I mean, you know, I could put a magazine rack up or something, maybe. A bobblehead stand, um, which, uh, I don't know, might be interesting, maybe. I mean, I have bobbleheads in my, um, inventory anyway, so, um, you know. I don't really have a good place to put it, though. Here, we'll try to, we'll put it against this. No, that'll be in the way of the stairs when you walk up the stairs. We'll put it right here. Not really the best at decorating. I think my uh, camp pretty much speaks to that. So we've got a bobblehead stand there. And um, if I want to transfer, I could transfer something to the bobblehead stand. And I have two bobbleheads here. I've got a science bobblehead and a small guns bobblehead. And um, they're just on the display case there, you know. Just, um, just on the display case for us to look at. Or, you know, shoot. There. A little bit of shooting practice there. So, I mean, I guess that's kind of neat, right? Um, do I have more bobbleheads in my stash? If I do, let's go ahead and get them out and just put them on the bobblehead stand. I mean, why not, right? Uh, those are under aid, I believe. Um, I guess those are the only bobbleheads I've got. And then uh, I believe that, um, you know, you should have some reading material in your uh, living area, right? Uh, so I'm gonna put a, uh, you know, just a little magazine stand here. And then um, we can uh, put some uh, magazines on it since I've got so many freaking magazines. Um, a sign, a sign. A sign. There's like a delay. Look at all the magazines I've got. Oh, okay, first of all I have to, oh no, I, I assign with a different key over here, okay. Okay, way more magazines than I thought I did. I have two two copies of Unstoppables 1. There. I got a little magazine rack there. You know. Just just, you know, we could whoa. We could look at our magazines. It's pretty neat. You know. I'm storing them anyway. Why not? They're taking up space. Why not put them on display? That's fun, right? Yeah, it's kinda fun. It's not that fun. It's kinda fun. What else can we build? Let's go back in here to build and see what else we've got. We've got floor decor. Uh, that's pretty ugly. Pumpkin rack. Uh, most of these are locked. Uh, I could put down a cat topiary if I really wanted to. Uh, I could put down a hug vault boy cutout. Uh, which I actually... Whoa. Okay, well. Uh, it's looking like I've been kicked off the server. And I have been disconnected from the server... Indeed, so, um, yeah, this, it is, 
God, I don't even know what day of the week it is. It's Wednesday night as I'm recording this. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm, I don't think that they're going down for maintenance anytime soon. Um, they're supposed to go down for maintenance on February 6th, I think it said, which is tomorrow. So the servers aren't down yet. We should be able to get right back in here. We got more building to do. More odds and ends to place in our camp just to make the place homey um, to see what other plans we, we picked up. Somebody else had a really neat idea in the comments. Uh, remember a long time ago when I drank some uh, Nuka Shine and I woke up in a mysterious location on the map? I love that idea. Uh, I have to see if I could find or craft uh, more Nuka Shine and do that again because I think that's a really neat idea. But we're not going to do that in this episode. This episode is all about just... Uh, homeying up our camp a little bit so back into build mode we go floor decor um a rug we've got a mat Ooh, put a put a mat here in front of my door i mean come on it doesn't say welcome it's just a mat just just wipe your feet oh okay we, we have more than one we've got that one and we got this one and we've got this one that actually does say welcome and um there's a whole bunch of them yeah. Well, I mean, let's just make few people feel welcome here. So let's go ahead and put down uh, this one. Yeah. Let's put a little welcome mat down there. That's kind of nice. Let's see. A picnic blanket. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we'll just put a picnic blanket there. There. <laughs> All right. Whatever. You can have a picnic blanket there. What's this thing? Uh, a rug. Yeah. That's not really my style. It's uh, not my style. Uh... Uh, we could put a bearskin rug down here. Sure, why not? We'll plop that down. It just takes some cloth. I've got a ton of cloth. Here is a Vault Boy statue. That's kind of neat, right? You could have, like, uh, you know, like if you don't have any friends, you know, you could just have Vault Boy over. You know, there you go. There, now, now it feels like you've got uh, some friends around. You know, and then you've got, um, you know, this guy over here. You know, he's standing over here. He's like, yeah, man, your place is rad. Because he'd, he'd say rad, you know, because, whoa, what happened? Um, did I not place it? <laughs> okay, um, what the hell? Okay, that I, I'm pretty sure I built both of those, but I don't know where they went. Did they fall through the, the world here? They're like on the ground down here somewhere? Um... I don't know where the hell they went. Well, that sucks because it used steel to make them, and I am now out of steel. Are they? They're upstairs. Okay, for whatever reason, the game decided to put these guys upstairs. That kind of sucks because I really don't want two of them. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and store this guy, and uh, this guy we're gonna move. Um. So yeah, I don't know what his deal is, but um. Can't seem to place him where I want to, so we'll just we'll just stick him here. There we go. Okay, cool. He makes a little noise when you place him. Switch back over to build. Um, wow, we've got statues. Oh man, we got a a baseball statue. That's cool. Let's see where can I put this. This is neat. Where am I gonna put my baseball guy statue? Um, where would be a cool place for him? <laughs> yeah, I could put him oh it'd be neat if I could put him on this rock oh I can I can put him on the rock there oh come on game let me put him oh 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 I was thinking about it there we go <laughs> that's funny I think that's kind of cool up there he's like kicking his foot up he's getting ready to swing you know yeah that's cool I like it that's neat but I think it's funny because uh, I think when you fast travel to my camp you like materialize here and then you turn around it's like whoa the guy standing behind you. That's kind of cool, right? I think it is. Alright, that was fun. And then we've got uh, Fountain, which is freaking massive. Look at the size of this thing. Golly. Um, do I need a fountain? I don't know. It's starting to look a little gaudy, wouldn't you say? It's starting to look a little ridiculous around here. I think one copper statue is enough. Thank you very much. we got some shelves. Um... Which I don't know whether I put up any shelves in my bedroom up here or not. 
I think I put end tables, but I don't think I put any shelves. And this is a surprisingly small bedroom. It's a lot of furniture in this bedroom. Um, but, you know, let's put some more in it. Just uh, plop this here right at the... Right underneath the uh, window there. And, uh, oh, that required steel to make as well. I didn't realize that. We got vendors. We already did that. Tables. Um, do I need another table? Yeah, something else I don't have is really like a dining room, do I? Yeah, it's not really a dining room kind of place. Oh, I got a pool table. That's kind of cool. Wow, that takes cloth, plastic, rubber, steel, and wood to make. But uh, I don't really feel like this is a... Uh, pool table kind of place I don't feel like so we got some wall decor you know we could put up these ugly things if we wanted to we could put up some uh, pictures and such uh, again as far as you know what I got at the camps versus uh, what I got um, elsewhere I don't know miscellaneous structures fast knocked hanging ribbons uh, different types of those we've got a punch bowl the punch bowl is a container which can dispense mixed drinks in your camp. Huh. Okay, I wonder how that works. I'm kind of curious about it, but I don't like that it uses steel. Um, I don't really have a place to put it. I guess I do need a table, don't I? Let's go back to tables. We'll put... Um, uh, I'd rather do a wooden table so I don't have to use what little bit of steel I've got left. It's a, well, that's a lame table right there. Uh, although I could use it as kind of uh, makeshift um, counter space, right? Could do that. It's not the best. We got this longer table. We've got a round table. These are these are teeny tiny tables. Uh, that's like a f yeah. Oh well. Uh, got any better tables? really don't have a lot of table choices. It's kind of disappointing, the table choices I got here. These are all hideous. Yeah, I don't like those at all. Um, hmm. Well, yeah, no, no real good table choices as far as I'm concerned. I don't really care for any of these. Yeah, these all suck. These tables suck, man. I, I'm, I can't believe how many uh, plans there are still out in the game that I haven't found, right? I mean, look at all this stuff. But, I mean, even if I had the plans for a lot of these, I, I just think the tables kind of suck. Yeah. Hmm. Well, um, which, is, which was the least of the... I'll put this one down. The least of the suck. I'll just put it down right here. Kind of line it up. There. And now... I can uh, go to miscellaneous structures and put this uh, bowl on it, which is actually a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Okay, so we've got this thing here. And um, I walk over to it. I could transfer something into it, uh, but I ain't got nothing. So that was probably a waste, but oh well. I guess maybe I need a, uh, a still or something. I have a fermenter. Um, wow, I have nothing to put in here? Huh, okay. Uh, I thought for sure I'd have some crap. I mean... I'm carrying a lot of something. Holy cow, what am I carrying? That weighs so damn much. What the hell am I carrying? Uh, the age-old question, right? Well, this Stalker's 50 caliber machine gun, for one. Yeesh. Um, I mean, it's only level 25. It's only one star. I don't want this thing. It's super heavy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to scrap it to make, it make up some space. Oh, no, I can't scrap it as legendary. Well, crap. Well, uh... Uh, okay, well, I'll, ta I'll take care of that later. Let's go back into build mode. Miscellaneous structures. I uh, can't build a... Holy cow. Oh, I was going to say, look at the size of this tent. It's just a normal size tent. Nothing to get excited about. But this one here, apparently there's plans for this thing somewhere in the game world. Um, we got this thing here. And uh, really not a whole lot else in the way of... Um, Miscellaneous structures, huh? I'm kind of surprised. I thought I had more than that. <laughs> yeah. These, uh, all these little, little, little teeny, teeny tiny letters, they need steel. We put some of those on our vending machines a couple episodes ago. Wow, is that really that big? Got a cool glow in the dark map. We got a freaking Yao Guai head. 
uh, a mounted stingwing. Holy cow, I have 43 of these. Well, no wonder, ugh, no wonder so many people have these in their place because there's so freaking many. I'm looking at a mounted cat head. <laughs> Brahmin heads. Um, well, I'm certainly not going to mount anything there. I don't even know if I have a good place to mount anything. Let's see, let's see what's upstairs. Um, here, we'll put something over top of our uh, Tinker's uh, workbench. Let's see what looks good. That looks pretty good. Antlers, antlers, antlers. Wolf head. <laughs> I don't even want to look at that. Oh, okay, so a lot of these are locked. Okay. I saw, in the upper right-hand corner, I see variant. See where it says mounted Mylurk hunter head? Underneath that, it says variant 25 of 43. For some reason, I thought it was telling me that I had 43 of these, but I don't, unfortunately. Look at the size of that. The mounted Mothman. <laughs> uh, feral ghoul. Rad scorpion head. So there's some... Some neat stuff in here, but it says find plans. I mean, apparently there are plans to be found to build all these things. But we have some stuff. We can put something up here. We have some pretty cool stuff. Uh, I kind of like, um, kind of like this one, the mounted rad stag heads. I kind of like these. Let's put these up here. Nice. There we go. I kind of dig that. That's pretty cool. We don't over, want to overdo it. We don't need to put any more up here. You know, we don't we don't want to go crazy. What's this thing? Wind chimes. Ooh, some wind chimes. That'd be nice. Let's put some wind chimes outside. Let's put some wind chimes up here. You know, in the corner. And? No? It's green, game. Can I play some or not? Okay, well, it's telling me that it's floating. Well, game, I don't think you know what you're talking about. It's either green or it's not. You need to make up your mind. Oh, it's thinking about it. Oh, it's thinking. Either that or it's going to crash. Hey, it worked. I have some wind chimes. You can hear them. Listen. Okay, I don't hear them now. There, there. There's some nice wind chimes. Yeah, very nice. There's a storm brewing over there. Nice day. Nice view. Did my guy just pick his nose? <laughs> he didn't need to scratch his nose. No pick, no pick. It's just a scratch. Uh, let's see, what else we got? Um, let's uh, try on some different clothes. Since I went to the trouble of making them. We've got an Arctos lab coat, apparently. That's kind of cool. Pretty neat looking. Oh, that's really cool. Got the symbol on the back. Yeah, I kind of dig it, man. It's pretty cool. Whoops, that's not the right thing to press. I was trying to zoom out. That's something that I can't quite figure out how to do, so... So long as I'm not in my camp, in my building circle, um, I can uh, go over here, and now I can uh, hold down my mouse middle button and hold it down, and I can like zoom out, right? I can do that. But if I'm in my camp, uh, and I press my middle mouse button, it goes into build mode, so I can't zoom out then. But uh, it's okay, we could just walk over here and do it. Looks very distinguished. Looks Sounds like we have a visitor. One of these, um, officer guys running around over here. Could even be up there on that tower, I don't know. Could be. Whoop, I didn't do that. Stop it, game. Well, you know, just hanging out with our gun. What are you doing, dude? Okay, putting our gun away. Okay, next outfit in our fashion show. The blue and tan shirt and slacks. Oh, yeah, that's a good look. I like that. I think it looks good. That's a good look on this guy. Wouldn't you agree? Looks pretty good. I don't know about the pants, though. They're a little formless, but uh, I like the shirt. Yeah, I kind of dig it. The dude's kind of dapper looking, you know? Um, 
there's different like styles in the game. Like you could change the way your dude looks um, in um, the. Uh, well, here I'll just tell you what, show you what I'm talking about. If I could get to it. So in the Atomic Shop, there's these styles, right? These different styles. Like I have the curly bun style apparently, and uh, I also own full eye black smudge, full eye smudge, full diamond. These are just free ones that the game gives out occasionally. I did not buy these. But um, I do not know how to apply those. Um, yeah, I don't I don't even know where I would um, put those. Uh, I mean, or, or make them. Like, if there's something I'm supposed to craft, where would I craft a style? So... I don't know how to do that. I mean, it's not really apparel. And I guess it'd be kind of weird if it showed up under apparel. But um, I don't know where the styles are at all, man. I have no idea. Don't know, what, don't know what to do about that. So many things I don't understand. Looks like my dude's getting a little thirsty. So let's bring up my inventory here. That's not my inventory. Bring up my inventory here. Go back into aid. And um, I kind of wish that there was a way I could sort by what do I have the most of, you know? Um, because I'd like to take the food item that I have the most of and then assign a hotkey to it. Uh, but I don't, I don't have that. So it's interesting. I have Unstoppables 1 on my person. Is it also in my camp? You know, is it also on that uh, thing I built? I'm not sure how that works exactly. What the? My magazine rack is gone. What the hell, man? All right, game. I don't. I don't like you taking things away from me. That's not cool. Okay, my magazine rack does not appear to have appeared upstairs. Well, that sucks. I built that thing and put all my magazines on it, and now it's gone. That's baloney. The hell, game? Sheesh. Um, well, at least my uh, wind chimes are still there. I could hear them. Um, so I, I mean, when my magazine rack disappeared, did my magazines all go into my inventory? Um,. Yeah, there's my live and loves. Um, they're not all here though. My bobbleheads are still in my inventory. That's weird. Huh. Yeah, it's kind of strange. So let's. Wait a minute. Was was my bobblehead thing still upstairs? I don't think it was. I wonder if when I got kicked off the server, I, I some things disappeared. I'm thinking that's what happened, man. When I got kicked off the server... Yeah, my bobblehead stand is gone too. Well, I wonder if like the materials that I used to craft them are also gone. That sucks. Huh. What the hell, man? What is up, game? Display. Look at this. I can't, I can't make the bobblehead stand because I don't have steel now. Well, that's a bunch of baloney. That's a bunch of baloney, I tell you. That's what it is. Scrap items. Scrap all junk. I've scrapped junk. Uh, I have a Gatling laser that's pretty neat, but I'm not specced for it, so we'll just get rid of that. Ooh, and I got something. It's kind of cool. And then um, this wood left arm. I don't need that. Um, yeah. Okay. Now do I have enough steel? Now that I scrapped stuff? Let's see. I do. Just, just enough. Let's put this back here, man. I feel cheated. I feel cheated, man. Put my bobbleheads on there. Alright. There we go. 
Oh, my bobbleheads are back. Nice. And then uh, we should be able to build this um, magazine stand again because it's it's wood and I have plenty of wood. And oh oh, there we go. Magazine stand transfer. Magazine rack is what it is. I thought I had more magazines than this. Didn't I? I feel like I did, but maybe I didn't. There. There, stuff on my magazine rack. Yeah, I think that's the same amount. I'm pretty sure it's the same amount. I didn't get cheated out of magazines. All right. Let's, let's pick another outfit. I've got all these outfits here. Well, let's check them out. Uh, clean striped suits. Ooh. Whoops. Look at that. Oh, oh, see? I tried to zoom out and it put me into build mode. Oh man, more purified water. That's awesome. Nice. There, let's, let's check this outfit out, huh? Pretty nice. Not my favorite. I like the pink suit better, to tell you the truth. Huh, never really looked at my camp from this angle before. How it stupidly hangs off the edge of the world there and just floats. Just pretend like those posts go all the way to the ground down there. That's what's holding this whole place up. It's a pretty big place, really. I can see why I'm pretty much maxed out on my budget. It's a big place. Used a lot of wood to build it. And, um, you know, over here, there's even more to it. You know, down these stairs here. Got this other little side area here so it's, it's kind of cool uh, here's my ammo I think I have more ammo to sell let's go ahead and add these uh, rounds uh, apparently I don't have any rounds for sale right now uh, big explosions going on so let's go ahead and sell this let's sell it sell all of it for just one a piece I've had people buy it um, 50 caliber rounds. I can't remember whether people buy this or not. Uh, yeah, you know, people do buy these. So we'll go ahead and throw some of these in there. I'm just going to sell them for one a piece. I don't care. And then, um, five millimeter rounds. People buy those. Sell those for one a piece as well. Plasma cores. People buy those. And, uh, they sell for a pretty penny, really. Not 162. Wait a minute, I got missiles? I don't want missiles. Plasma core. Man, this game thinks missile sells for a lot. Well, this too. We'll get down to about... 40 or so. There we go, that'll work. Shotgun shells. Uh, I've got a lot of them for sale here. Apparently people aren't buying my shotgun shells, huh? But uh, we'll just go ahead and throw those on the pile. And um, these rounds I should just drop. This other stuff I'll just drop on the ground. If somebody wants to pick it up, that's fine. That's totally fine. Um, yeah, this other stuff is garbage. This I'm using. This I'm using. Fuel. I don't think anybody's buying it. Fuel, fusion cells. We'll go ahead and put those over here as well just to add them to the pile. Nobody's buying my gamma rounds. I figured people might want those, but I guess they don't. Okay. That's cool. Uh, let's go ahead and drop this stuff on the ground like I said I was gonna. Drop this ammo here. Drop it all. Drop it all. Drop it all. And I don't care about these missiles either. I'll never use these. Same thing with the fuel. I'll never use the fuel. Okay. We'll drop all that on the ground. Just throw it on the ground. Did I, there we go. Just just a paper bag sitting there. Just for anybody to take. Let me see if I have any more outfits to put on. Uh, 
We've got... Nuka World Geyser shirt and jeans. There we go. That's... That's a little more comfortable. I don't particularly care for the rolled up jeans and the untied shoes. But I do like the shirt. The shirt's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool shirt. Well, um... I can't sit on my couch. There we go. I can sit on my couch. I'm going to hang out here on my couch. Uh, I'm going to end this episode uh, now. I know it's shorter than most of my episodes, but uh, I, you don't want to hear about my gripes and complaints and woes, but I have been working a massive amount of hours, and um, I just needed to throw again throw together a quick episode so I had something to post tomorrow uh, because I am uh, way behind because of all the work I've been doing. But I uh, just wanted to, wanted to throw together a quick episode a little bit of something here so that you guys have something to watch. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did want to let me know, leave me a like or a comment. Uh, several of you have given me some suggestions on some other things I could do while we wait for um, the uh, Wastelanders DLC. I appreciate that. If you have any other suggestions on what I could do or some fun things you'd like to see me do, let me know in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sure you'll join me again in the next episode.